The savage, rocky shores of Christmas Island, 200 miles south of Java in the Indian Ocean. It's November, the moon is in its third quarter, and the sun is just setting. And in a few hours from now, on this very shore, a thousand million lives will be launched. These crabs are all females, and of a kind that occurs only on Christmas Island. As darkness falls, more and more of them appear, clambering resolutely down to the sea. Now it's nearing midnight. Their numbers can only be guessed at, but on the island as a whole, there are probably 120 million of these crabs, and nearly all the adult females among them have chosen this time for their annual spawning. A crab like this is carrying about 100,000 eggs, and she has to shed them directly into the sea if they are to hatch. But that's a hazardous business for her, because although her far distant ancestors came from the sea, she herself is a land crab, and she can't swim. So if a wave sweeps her away, she will assuredly drown. But nonetheless, her compulsion to launch the next generation is irresistible. And when at length she does reach the sea, her triumph is apparently ecstatic. The crabs have picked the moment when the tide is at its highest, so that they have the shortest distance to travel across the beach to reach the water. The astronomical numbers of their eggs turn the clear ocean water into a black, turbid soup. As dawn approaches and the tide recedes, so the eggs are swept out to sea. <laughs> 